Weezer. I, I, I'm not doing that intro again. I hated that intro. So, right now, I am gonna basically be the part two of ranting about Flower Boy. But, but now it's just Tyler Creator. So, yeah. Little disclaimer here. Um, I'm not gonna be talking about Goblin or Cherry Bomb. Because both of those albums suck. Um, I'm gonna just be talking about Flower Boy for a little bit. I mean, I already have, like, a video on that. So you should just watch that. But either way, Flower Boy is a beautiful album. And it's great. And just listen to it. So, something really fun to do is whenever kids are like, My favorite album is about Taylor Swift breaking up with her ex. Well, my favorite album is about a man going through a love triangle. And he really wants to date his friend, but I don't think his friend is gay. But And now he really wants to kill his friend's, you know, like, girlfriend. Because he really wants to date his friend. But then he has to accept that his friend's using him for his love. And um, he has to, like, kind of um, say, stop being a puppet. And then, then he wants to be friends again. Igor is definitely some of the best albums. I mean, really, e Igor's story is so great. It's just so great. And, um, yeah, I don't know what else to say. It's such a good album. Like, Tyler Creator's storytelling is so majestic and great. Like, like the line, they say the loudest in the room is the weakest, but I say the loudest in the room is the loneliest. I love how just great his songs are. Like, Tyler Creator's songs are just so great. I mean, he might dress like your grandpa, but, you know, he still rocks the hardest fit anyway. Why else? Tyler Creator is the best. It just shows his character development. Let me explain this. Now, oh, in his first two albums, he... Sings about, oh, we, we don't talk about what he sings about. We don't do that here. Let's talk about Wolf. You know, this album, not gonna lie, is pretty good. So I remember listening to this, like, on a plane or, like, after getting off a plane. And, like, the baby was crying there for four hours. So just listening to Wolf really changed it, made, it, made my ears finally feel happy again. So, yeah, I got to say it's a pretty good album. For Tyler's standards, it's a 7 out of 10. Every other artist would probably be an 8 out of 10. So, like I said before, I'm not going to be talking about Cherry Bomb. That album sucks. But now, here is the character development part. So, in these last three albums, he, he, he's pretty mental. But in Flower Boy, it, it's beautiful. He, he finally goes into his emotions. And I love this album, as you know. And um, it's such great storytelling again. But it's not storytelling, it, it's lines. I, I don't know. It's just, it's just really good. It's hard to explain. But, you know, Igor is where you can really start seeing the character development. So, in Igor, like, like I've yapped about for 28 seconds, like two minutes ago in the video. Um, and it's about this dude in a love triangle. He really wants to date his friend, but his friend has a girlfriend, right? So, he does not like his girlfriend and kind of wants to beat him up, her up. And wants to make out with his um boyfriend or like this friend, and um, but then he has to accept that he needs to stop loving him because he does not love him anymore, because he does not feel any love from his from his friend. It's really confusing, but there's probably better videos on it you should watch. Before we go back talking about. Call me if you get lost. This video is sponsored by the subscribe button. Subscribe right now. So, Call Me If You Get Lost is such a beautiful album, too. 
why it shows the character development basically at its not most but close to its most is um because he's going back to his old rapping style but he doesn't say the same amount of offensive things so let's go back talking about some of his greatest songs so not number one i'm not gonna this is not in any particular order but number one probably new magic one i've been wanting to talk about this song this song is great like top 10 songs of all time probably like number five number four even it's a really good song and i gotta admit new magic one like definitely top tyler not number one tyler but you know definitely tyler's some of tyler's best work um 911 mr lonely um another beautiful song i mean this is this is my favorite song so yeah, I mean I don't know how to describe it, but it's really it's really good. Another thing that I don't know how to describe is um how to end this video. So yeah, hit that subscribe button and um, go watch another one of my videos right now.